Ignatius, 47 here, and welcome to the Desert Colossus. Oh, yes. I hate those freaking things. Get out of my face, man. Damn it. No, get out of here. No! Ha <laughs> ha. Do now, bruh. Hmm. But where is that? I know we've got. Oh man, I tell ya. Eat a dick. Get out of here. Man, that, that's some aggravating stuff. I wonder. I think there's a way to make this fill up with water. <gasps> I have an idea. Who knows if it'll work. It's been a long time. So, <laughs> here's the trying, though. Um... Song of Storms, right? Yeah. Nice. Oh, that's amazing. That's what I thought it did. I just wanted to make sure. <clears throat> Go ahead and heal up. And we're going to... Would you stop it? Gotcha. Just drown all these fairies. And let's do the hammer for now. Things that don't use uh, equipment or Got it. All right. That's really frustrating. Somewhere here, one of the walls is explodable, and there is a um, quest. There's a, a, a great fairy fountain, and she gives you like this shieldy magic spell. Not hugely needed in this particular case. I can't go through that. I don't know that I can push this. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. All right. Well, shit. Nothing I can really do here. Time to go outside. For a cutscene. What's up, man? How you doing? <laughs> Past, present, future. The Master Sword is a ship with which you can sail upstream and downstream through Time's River. The port for that ship is in the Temple of Time. To restore the Desert Colossus to enter the Spirit Temple, you must travel back through Time's Flow. 
Let's do this Requiem of Spirit. This melody will lead a child back to the desert. A down A right down A Sorry, I had to take my phone. You've learned the Requiem of Spirit. That was a cutscene anyway. So long, bruh. It's been a blasty. It's pretty impressive to be able to call up a, uh... Thing. I want to say she's visible... No. Oh, wait. She is whenever you arrive at the temple. Anyway. Is that not it? What? What's the tune that I'm looking for here, guys? I need to get to the... Upright, upright. What? Yeah, that's what I did. There we go. And now that we have the song to fast travel here, we can go become a kid. Get back over here. Yeah. <sighs> And, um, do some of this quest. This is the, I think this is the only temple. Yeah, this is the only temple where it's both, you have to do some of it as a kid and some of it as an adult. It gets a little crazy sometimes, man. Yes. <sighs> I hate... Uh, they annoy me immensely. Go away. Creepy things. Mm -hmm. Hello, lady. Sexy lady. What do you want? Nothing, really. Nothing to do? What good timing. Can you do me a favor, kid? If you give her the other two options, uh, she, you gotta talk to her again, by the way. I hate Ganondorf. Uh-huh, you got guts. I think I like you. First of all, let me introduce myself. I'm Nibiru of the Gerudo. I'm a lone wolf thief. But don't get me wrong. Though we're both thieves, I'm completely different from Ganondorf. With his followers, he stole from women and children, and he even killed people. 
Kid like you may not know this, but the Gerudo race consists only of women. Only one man is born every hundred years. Even though our laws say that a lone male Gerudo must become king of the Gerudo, I'll never bow to such an evil man. By the way, what is your name, kid? Narp? What kind of name is that? <laughs> oh, I love it. I'll ask you a favor. Will you go through this tiny hole and get the treasure that's inside? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> uh, adulthood has ruined me on innuendo like that. That's hilarious. Anyway, we're out of time. We'll uh, continue this little dungeony bit in just a moment. So, uh, till then, 